Oh. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to part two of the Senior Pan Am Champs vlog in Guatemala. Sorry, this isn't like a proper intro, but when I put together all the footage I filmed when I was there, it was over two hours long, so I decided to split it into two parts. Welcome to part two and I hope you guys enjoy. Day three in Guatemala, breakfast. <laughs> Oh my, thank you. Oh, she really like stuck it in there and went like done COVID test number three. Time to warm up for my match. Another power outage. Great. Oh gosh. Okay. What's going on? I just finished my game. Mm -mm. Update one. But in three games, my god, it was so bad. The second game, at the end, I was like, screw this. I'll just try again in third game. So, so far, I was like, in the second game, I kept on thinking the back line shots were out, but they were all like in. Every single time, it was like just in, and I'm like, but like, it's faster on one side and slower on the other. Anyways. That was bad. Hopefully next one's better, but I'm playing so soon. Um, I don't have time to go back to get lunch, so Jennifer's bringing me my lunch. 12.15 now, and I play at 2.30, so hopefully Jennifer comes back with my food so I can eat a little before my game. Next game, I'm also playing Peru. I played her many times, actually. Hopefully I play okay, better than just now, and I actually like hit the bird when it's in. Also, I didn't know quarters were today until like but right before my match. Oh yeah, also I forgot to tell you guys, there was literally a power outage during my game. Like a couple times the lights just went out and I was just like, huh? Lights went out and then we just like stopped playing for like maybe five minutes and then the lights came back on and then we started again. And then they went out again, so. This Pan Am tournament things. Also, third game, first half, I literally snapped my strings in the middle of a rally and I was like, oh my God, are you kidding me? And then I just kept rallying and then I won the rally. But I was like, yes. But I literally thought I was gonna smash into the net because my strings were broken. I'll insert that clip.
Update, I won two games, 21-13, 21-13. I was a little nervous at the beginning. First game was kind of close up until 11, and then I like took off, it was good. Second game was like good as well. More confidence in my opponent, kind of. I feel like she gave up. Now it's like almost four o'clock and I'm finally having lunch because Jennifer brought me. It's pasta with white sauce. Taste test. Oh, it's not bad. It's literally not bad. Maybe I'm just hungry. Solid 8 out of 10. A few moments later. Currently 4 something. The bus is at 5, so we can't leave yet. So we're gonna watch men's singles quarterfinals. Currently, Sank is playing against Igor from Brazil. And Brian is playing... Some dude from El Salvador. I've actually never seen him before. So I'll insert some clips of rallies. dinner i'll insert some pics of what i had right here there was soup there was beef but it was kind of like really well done and it was really hard to chew and cut but it's okay i guess literally had the whole restaurant to myself because joe was like originally eating with me but then she realized she missed the last bus to the venue so she had to rush and figure out what to do because she has a match tonight but then sank tim and some other u.s players came so they joined me and now I'm back in my room. I need a stretch because I'm kind of really sore from my matches. Forgot to stretch yesterday because I was running to catch the bus, so that's bad. I'm gonna stretch now and then I'm probably gonna do some game analysis because I'm playing Bay Wen tomorrow. She's literally ranked 14th in the world, like I'm just trying my best. Exciting experience for tomorrow. I'm just gonna do that for the rest of the night. It's kind of boring if I vlog that. So I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning guys, day four or five in Guatemala. Today I'm playing semifinals. It's 8.30 in the morning right now and I'm about to head down to have breakfast. I'll insert some pictures here because I don't want to vlog again. It's always the same breakfast. I'm gonna take the nine o'clock bus. I play at 10.30 against Bay Wen. I watched some of her games yesterday and obviously she's really good she's like ranked 14th in the world so obviously she's good I have a strategy going in hopefully I do well wish me luck guys Welcome to Talia's vlog. She's about to get her PCR test done. Um, Y'all are like scaring me. You like tilt your head? Mm, 
my god. <laughs> You're so lame. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, relax, so just relax. I swear, it's like bigger than normal. In and out. In and out. Oh. Took it like Oh wow, look at you. Nicely done. Hey guys, good morning. Day six. I think in Guatemala. Sorry, I didn't vlog yesterday. I kind of forgot and I was also kind of upset after my games. I'll do a little update now. Basically, first game was pretty good. I was being pretty aggressive at the beginning and it was going well. I got her on a couple of my slices, so that was really good. And I was leading at 11, but then I made stupid mistakes after and then she kind of caught up. And then it kind of went downhill from there. Second game, it was not good. It was like 8:21. It was bad. I was so passive second game and I don't know why I was like out of breath but i was literally fine like the entire tournament i don't know and the rallies weren't even that long i don't know why i was out of breath so weird i feel like ugh, i feel like honestly i could have taken it three games if i maintained my speed and if i maintained the attack because the second game i was way too passive and i think my speed went down a lot of the shots i was super passive and i hit it high and then i wouldn't give myself enough time to get back to the middle to defend good experience though i'm just like kind of upset because i feel like i could have performed better anyways i already wrote up a list of everything i have to work on so hopefully when i get back to toronto i can go back to training after my quarantine and then work on those things so next time if i play her again i can do better so today is finals day i'm not playing but i'm gonna warm up with rachel because she's playing against baywin in finals today i'll also be watching the other games as well so i'll insert some clips at the practice court, just finished warming up with. How do you feel for your singles match later? Finals against Bay Wen Jang. Okay. No, I'm not nervous. I'm not nervous at all. No pressure at all. I can't tell if you're being sarcastic yes. or if you're being serious. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous now that you put the camera in front of my face. Why? This is like just for funsies. <laughs> if this gets a thousand views in one week, I will say good job, Taylor. Anyways, let me show you guys my mosquito bites. One, two, three, four. Can I take out my hair? Oh, it's good. Normal. Hair. Okay. Okay. Let me continue counting my mosquito bites. Five, six. Yeah, I think that's it. So itchy though. My God. Wow. 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 Okay, update. I was gonna vlog some of the men's singles because it was the first match, but by the time I came after I warmed up with Rachel, it was already done. Apparently, Jason like retired. The first game was 21 13, Brian won, and then the second game, Brian was leading 18 10, and then Jason retired. But Jason still has doubles later, so I don't know if he'll be allowed to play since he retired singles. Also, that was like a really important match because Olympic qualifications heavily influenced by the winner of this match. Women's singles is next. I'll insert some clips. Right now, Josh and Joe are playing mixed finals and they won the first game 21-18 but literally at the end of the first game, Joe was going for like a mid-court, like it was over there but then she like let it pass and then Josh whipped it and I think the bird almost hit her eye. They had to like stop for a second and the medics had to come on and give her ice and stuff but hopefully she'll be okay. Hopefully they'll finish it in two games. Okay, hey guys, it's Tally here currently editing and I realized my explanation doesn't do the situation justice so I'm gonna insert a clip of what happened because Joe got hit really hard. I was like so scared when I was like watching. Here's a clip of what happened.
20 match point 18. 18 match point. update also apparently because Jason retired from singles he's not playing doubles so only women's doubles left Update vlog, we just got our medals, what it looks like, and we also got okay, guys, these thingies. Oh my gosh! Woo! That's the energy that's you gotta that's have! That's I'm oh my god, okay, anyways, I guess that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and subscribe if you want to. Shush! You're disturbing me! Oh my god, okay. As I was saying, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you want to. And yeah, I guess that's it. See you guys in the next one. Bye!